giving me like the thing to tell me that we're streaming uh, which is weird and makes me worry that I'm not actually streaming and this won't record but we're just gonna kind of have faith and go with it so I'm Trey Guillotine welcome to my channel this is a new episode of what you gaming on where we start every episode by asking you the gamer what are you gaming on if you want to tell me what game you're playing what you like about it what you don't like about it your answer will be featured in an upcoming video segment we're gonna go ahead and jump in on to what I've been gaming on and I have been playing Final Fantasy 7 remake which I seem to not even be close to running out of good things to say about it uh, I don't want to go into too much detail about it I did write a that will be coming out like on the UNO Driftwood website. Uh, so look forward to that. But until then, I do just want to say that overall, I love it. It's fantastic. I'm I'm truly amazed at how good this game is. Uh, I don't I didn't I wasn't expecting it to suck. I was just worried that it wasn't going to live up to expectations. Uh, and so far, it has in a number of really big ways. Uh, so if you haven't played if you haven't played Final Fantasy VII, uh, now's the time to do it. If you have and you just want to return to Midgar, definitely jump into it. Don't worry about the story being changed. The story is the story has not been changed. They've simply added a lot more to it. Like they've given a lot more context and substance to it, which I think is fantastic. So go check that out. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna jump into a new stream of The Wolf Among Us, where the last we left, we found the beheaded head of Snow White on the front door of the woodland, so we're going to see what is going to happen next. So this is episode two. Mr. Toad? Do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place! Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. What the fuck are you talking about, you stupid cunt? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Look, whatever it is, it's totally between told, you and Beast. Beast. I'm staying out of it. It's not what you might be thinking. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Yeah, I did. Come with me. No. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow! You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. No, I'm D. He's dumb. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill one. I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. Ollie, you're out of paper towels and uh, they're gonna string me up, baby. Like you said, it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. All right, I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl named Fuck, man. This fucking lab dog. Come sniffing around this place. The rich fucks in the woods need a shake down. Yeah, right, Big B. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much.
What? You're making this more difficult than it has to be. If you just cooperate and answer the questions, you can go home. Maybe get some sleep. How are you feeling? I know it's been a long night for you. You look like you could use some rest. I'll be better when I find who did this. Which I can't do while sitting in here. We all want the same thing here, Big B. Do we? Look, I know what you must be going through. Really, I do. But I could use your cooperation. You know, I hate to say it, but I don't think you do. Of course. You're... you're right. I can't imagine what you're going through right now. Can you? Like, I know someone's on the other side of that glass. What is it with you cops? Always trying to empathize with people. I know this must be hard for you. Do you? Do you fucking know? Have you had a friend killed and their head left at your fucking doorstep? Yeah, fuck the man. No, didn't think so. Your nose is bleeding. Is she 11 from Stranger Things? Are you okay? You don't look so good. Detective Brannigan? I'm Detective Brannigan. Uh, yeah. I know. I just said that. Is there something... Do you hear that? Yeah. This is weird. Please. Please. I'm sorry. Just make it stop, please. Is Kilgrave here? Get that. We have to go now. Right. Not with you. What did you do to her? She'll be fine. It's just a memory wipe spell. Very expensive. 24 hours. And everything. Well, hurry up. It's going to be a finish my service. You know, for posterity. Good old New York. That's the shittiest car. <coughs> Sorry. Right. Changing. Fine. Good. Yeah, um, we found the up to a... That was incorrect. Not like you could well, have I don't know. Taint him. At the trip, Snow was left to be involved in this. Bluebeard's currently interrogating him. He's working for somebody, and whoever it is wants him snooping around every crime scene I've looked at. That doesn't I'm sorry, why is Bluebeard mean interrogating in the murders? Him? No, I'm just trying to do the job that you wanted me to do. That you're saying that I'm not doing. That when I'm trying to do it, you're saying I'm not doing it well. How about you do it? You also can't drive for shit. I know what you're thinking, Big B. It's been no, one full night in the morning, and I already miss her too. I'm gonna throw you out that window. You know, I never get more homesick than when one of us dies. Now, for it to be snow, I've never been good with these sorts of things. I just can't believe this is really happening. Give me a fuck fucking you. what? Treated her like the fucking maid, and now <laughs> you want a shoulder to cry on? You Good. You should remember that. That. that is not true. Not true at all. Very true. I thought we had some common Very ground. We could discuss this like gentlemen. No, you're not a gentleman. Let's get something straight here. All right. We have exactly nothing in common. 
Everything that connects us is dead. Gone. I don't know why I'm asking you. Did she give any indication? Last thing I saw. Why, but I'd like to know that she was... Yeah. She gave an indication she was pissed at you. By saying that she was pissed at you. At me? <laughs> she was frustrated with the whole fucking system. Tired of having to turn fables away. It wore her down. I don't know what else to say, Big B. We have to have to put an Thank end down. to this. It's been a true one that keeps talking many days. If we don't unearth our culprit, and soon there will likely be another on our doorstep tonight. Well, I'll I have my get it done. You know, please, Big person, B. and then Miss White. About I got it. it. Good. Glad I broke your car. I should do more to it, Dick. That's not a very good answer, is it? Come on. Just tell me what I want to know. It will make things a lot less painful for you. In theory. Oh, were you planning on using that? I just thought you really liked rubbing your little sword. Uh, what the hell do you think you're doing? Hello, Ichabod. Sheriff. Bluebeard. I was just chatting with our new friend. Loretta. You were supposed to wait for us to get back. I told you, if you want to be involved, you will do things my way. No violence! I know he told Whatever about you violence. say, Ichabod. Hello, Big B. I want answers, D. Oh, goody. I thought you wanted questions, and I was having so much trouble thinking of any good ones. Though I'd settled on, how's your head? You see what I've been dealing with? What are you going to do about this, Bigby? I'm glad you have a sense of humor. I hope that means you're willing to cooperate. Snow White is dead. Look, I didn't kill anyone. And I'm supposed to just believe you. You were with me when it happened, dummy. I still have questions for you, D. Sounds like a personal problem. This is ridiculous. Let him work. He's got more experience with these kinds of things. Why were you at Toad's place? Looking for a change of scenery. Thought I might move in. Had to take a look around first, of course. Yeah. All right, D. Let's get to know each other. What is it now, Big B? I'll ask you again. Why were you at Toad's? Having a cup of tea. <laughs> Fuck! <gasps> I can go all so, day. So, this is how it's gonna be. Just mm -hmm. tell me what you were doing at Toad's place. I can't tell you. And pushing me around isn't gonna change that. My brother and I work hard, and we keep our mouths shut. That's the deal. I forgot about your brother. Dumb, right? Our doing what? Are appropriate. Where was your brother last night? Are you a kid of something? What do you think? Maybe. He didn't are you get here? that. He didn't kill her. You have no fucking right to keep me here. You have no evidence. Give me my stuff and let me go. What did you find no. out? Oh, uh, nothing of consequence, really. That was a very small cigar. I hope you can take a punch, Bigby. Who's Myron? I'm saving that. I'm not. Look at this asshole. Mm hmm. Where's your brother? It's garbage. I don't know, okay? I haven't seen him since I left to go find Faith since we ran into Faith's you. What? But he didn't kill anybody, so you leave him alone. You don't call the shots here, D. You mentioned Faith. Why are you what here? about her? I went to her apartment. That's no secret. You saw me there. No, there's more to it. Mm -hmm. You said you were trying to find something. All right, D. 
What did you want from Faith? I'm not telling you shit. I mean, I can burn up. That's a lot of money to burn up. You just carry this around? It ain't illegal, is it? I mean, you don't. What the fuck? Big B, you sh- What are you doing? Getting answers. I My told job. you to keep yourself under control. Uh, let me handle this. What did you want from Faith? I didn't want shit from that little thief. More trouble than she's worth. I could oh, see the same about you. Oh, yeah? What did she steal? Must have been valuable. I don't know. It was just some dumb thing my boss was after. What did you say? Your boss. So let's talk about your boss, then. Come on, D. It's clear you're just following orders. Oh, who's calling the shots? No, I'm fucking done. Mm, are you, though? You have no... You always carry this much cash. I don't like banks. So what? I'm declaring a tax Mine on now. cooperative troublemakers. What the fuck kind of a shakedown is this? You'll need to account Effective for that. Effective one, you apparently. Can't just... No, I won't. There are procedures to be followed. No, there isn't. We'll talk about it later. Fuck your procedure. Last chance, Pete. Who are you working for? Fuck you! You're a piece of shit, Bigby! Beauty was right about you! You're just a sick- Beauty? You're full of shit. Oh, we're good friends. That's enough. I will not tolerate this savagery. You think someone was trying to kill Snow? Isn't it more likely someone was trying to get back at you by killing her? That's gonna be it's really your violent satisfying. violent behavior and inability to control your nature that caused this mess. <laughs> Fuck you! Do it. God damn it. What's going on down here? Huh? What a twist. This intro is so 80s. than my own apartment. Glad we have such good security. What the hell was going on down there, Bigby? My job. Abusing a prisoner like that. I was just doing my job. Oh, that's your job? Beating up people? Yes. Yes. Getting answers. Yes. I hope it was worth your time. Ah, so far, yeah. We got a few answers. You really scared us. If we'd just known- I was working on this case. After our conversation in the taxi Where? last night, I got a call from Toad. He said his son found a body. We thought it was Faith at the time. Getting her back here wasn't easy. But hopefully we'll find something on her to help us track down the killer. I'm glad you took care of things. Thanks. Snow? What is- I'm glad you're... not dead. Me too. I just want to get to the bottom of this. I just- like- What is it? I just... I feel- Responsible, in a way. She looked just Turn like on. me. And maybe that's why she was killed. I don't think it's about you. 
There's something else going on here. Just a message, maybe. Maybe. We just have to find out who did this. And why she was glamoured to look like me. I mean, that's what it is, right? So, that makes what's sense. Doing what doing. Are and I'm supposed to be business often with bad wolf eye problems? That's no. not what I mean. Well, then what? I told you, I'm tired of sitting around. I'm not going to be an errand girl for Crane anymore. I just want no, you to be careful. To be. I almost lost you once. I'm and... not yours to lose. I'm just, that's not what I meant. It's I'm sorry. I know it's dangerous, but I'm not helpless. I can take care of myself. I'm not asking you to be. I've been doing it for centuries. Shit, you're the only person I want TJ is waiting about. inside. He was so freaked out last night, he wouldn't tell us much. Even now, he just stops talking altogether after a certain point. He's pretty shaken up, though, so try not to be too, you know. To what? Myself. Right. Can say it. TJ's over there. I don't know if you want to talk first or after, but Audi, I I want to be there. Buffkin, do you? Have of course, Miss Snow. Let's talk to him first. Oh, that's enough. Mira, finish! Cancel! No. What the hell are you doing? Don't even get started with me, Sheriff! What's going on? I saw what you did what? down there. Is that how you treat your prisoners? How would you see what you did down there? I was in the basement. There's like the top floor. To do you good smack after what he put me through. But what you did to him was way over the bloody line. You scared the shit out of me, little boy. He saw everything. How? Okay, Mr. Toad. No. And what did you expect to see? I thought maybe I'd catch you on the shitter. But I saw something worse, didn't I? Oh, uh, with enough. the mirror. Duh. Mr. Toad, I deeply regret the distress this has caused you and your son. But right now, we need to care. I'll with you, but must understand how urgent this is. We need to talk to TJ. This ain't over, Big B. Is it ever? TJ. It's all right. Are you ready to talk to Mr. Wolf? Enough, Big B. You do anything to hurt me, boy. I will it's literally okay. take the hat off your head. Are you... okay? Go ahead, TJ. I go swimming at night sometimes. In the river. I wasn't doing anything bad. I promise. Of course you weren't. We know you're a good kid, TJ. You're not in trouble. Just tell me what happened. Who doesn't go swimming at the park? I was there, under the big blocks, and I heard noisy feet. And when I hear that, I'm supposed to go underwater and stay real still and quiet. That's right, son. And frogs? Then I saw... Breathe underwater? I... I saw the lady! Careful, Big B. I wasn't. Shut up, Toad. I know. The lady fell in, but but she didn't have her head on. That's probably thought, why she fell in. Couldn't see where she was going. I thought she was gonna pull me down too. <laughs> cause cause she had rocks on her feet, and she kept falling down in the dark parts. <laughs> Cinder blocks tied to her ankles. Is Some there real more, mob TV? shit. Is it true? 
You know when people are lying? I heard you could do that. That's why you're the sheriff. Yeah, it's my special power. I always know when people aren't telling me the truth. Is there something else you want to say? Please, don't be mad. What is it, TJ? I... under the water. What? I know I'm supposed to, but I was scared, and, and I went to the top again. I couldn't help it! I gave you very specific rules. You have to stay quiet and out of sight or bad things can happen. I told you! Leave him alone, Toad. He's my son. I've set boundaries for a reason. This is a special circumstance. Leave him alone. Boundaries you break all the time, so shut the fuck up. So you didn't stay underwater? I don't know if anyone saw me, but, but someone said, stop laughing. And then I was scared, and I went under for as long as I could. Wait, you heard someone? Yes. Why didn't you tell us before? Did you hear anyone laughing? No. <laughs> Did you see who it was? No. <laughs> Were those the same words they used? Stop laughing? Try to remember exactly what they said. They said... They said... Stop laughing... at me. Bigby, he's frightened. Do you know whose okay. voice it was? I don't know! I don't know! I'm sorry. After I came up again, there was no one there. And I ran home, that's all. I promise! I want to go home. Okay, you can go. <laughs> Thank you, TJ. Okay, son. You did a good job, kid. Come on, then. Like 90% sure that's the same voice as Clementine in Walking Dead. 95%. That went about as well as I expected. You want to go look at the body now? In a minute. When you're ready. I want to talk to the mirror. Check something out first. This really looks more like a gravy boat. Hello, Big B. Nice to see you. What were you showing Mr. Toad and his son? Cinderella selling shoes, Rapunzel, Rose, and of course there's you. And I can't help note that you did not rhyme. Do try to stick to the rules next time. Yeah, I'll do that. Where can I find Tweedledum? Uh, that piece of scum. Scum. That's uh, not a uh, Shakespeare, but. The woodsman and I were fighting. Now I want to know where he's hiding. That works. Well, that's helpful. It's a regular Tuesday for him. Like, this is a real fire hazard setup, just saying. So, check out anyone who fits that profile. You might start with Bluebeard. Right away, Miss Snow. Are you ready to examine the body now? Ready to examine your body. Yeah. Oh, goodness, I almost forgot. Come on. I wonder how much 
much is in that bowl? Okay, how do we get the head from the police station? I want to stay. I'll be fine. It's just a little strange. The glamour is so effective, it's invasive. But just do what you need to do. Check her mouth. There might be a ribbon in there, like before. Anything? Nothing. Can you close her mouth? Thanks. It looks just like Faith's dead. But a thing in her mouth this time. Do you think it was done by the same person? Hard to tell. Did Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? No. He said he wanted to run more tests. That's weird. I don't wear a brooch like that. Maybe it really belonged to her. Not part of the glamour. Looks like something from the homelands. Buffkin, do you recognize these symbols? No, nothing I've seen before. Fist is clenched. So she fought back. Maybe it's a note about a basilisk. Knuckles. Oh. Maybe she was grabbing something? Maybe. Crack. W what are you doing? Only way to find out. This is gonna be uncomfortable. Jesus, Bigby. What? what is it? She used Monday drugs? Looks that way. Pretty heavily, too. That's kind. I hear they only go for the legs if they've used up the veins in their arms. Or if they're trying they to hide between marks. their toes. Wait. If Not the that. glamour is supposed to make her look like me, shouldn't it be concealing things like that too? Why would it change everything else? I've never seen one this sloppy. It might be a cheap one. Just to get the job done. The witches upstairs know what they're doing, that's why they cost so much. Unless someone is making glamours illegally? It's not I mean, technically illegal, should. miss. It's not encouraged, for sure, but there aren't any laws specifically forbidding it. So there's some sort of black market for glamours? One would assume so. I imagine anyone with access to the proper books and training could theoretically produce a glamour. Yet another thing to worry about. Black market or not, it's a pretty good match. Look at that. The buttons aren't exact either. There's an X year. So maybe the clothes aren't part of the glamour. They just buy the clothes as close as they can make them. What are these, though? Rope marks. Oh, that's where they... She was tied up? They tied cinder blocks to her ankles. So she would sink. Oh. You're right. These buttons are wrong. I wonder... What? Do you shop at like TJ Maxx or something? Snow. I need to open her coat. Bigby, just let me. Alright. Got some whale tail going. Still okay. I 
I... Well, I certainly hope you're behaving yourself up here. I will literally throw you out a window. What have you found out? Give me another one. I'll smash your bottle. I haven't finished yet. Well, get on with it, then. We can't waste too much I time would, here. The killer might if be you would stop interrupting me. Speak. We should keep going. What is that? It's your perfume. How do you know what perfume I wear? You can't fool this, Nose. Looks like someone picked it out for her. Oh, the toilet. So, someone like, gave her instructions. I'm pretty sure that means toilet water, and I don't know why that's like perfume or cologne for French. It's fucking toilet. I've seen things like this before. Magic craft objects these days. I don't think it's wise to fool around with that. It's some kind of black market magic. Who knows what it could do? We should have it looked at. Just to make sure it isn't dangerous. Will you keep quiet? Huh. What? There's something in here. How do we open it? Might want to stand back if you're crane. Good night. Something to do with the or stand very here. close. Ooh, is this a um? I forget what it was called. The box in Da Vinci Code is a horse. It's a deer. A oh, deer. deer. What does that mean? Oh. Well, that's creepy. Is that? Up. Oh. Let's hope it's from your head. Someone must have taken this from my apartment. I it's noticed it was I think missing, but I didn't think the person this next to her is Ruby Rose. The picture I had of Rose and me. My sister and I yeah. don't talk much. Rose anymore. Red. Who did this, Bigby? She's a troll. That's rude. Shit. Well, that helps explain the glamour. Kind of. Who is she? That wasn't there before. Tattoo. Who do you Holly. think she is? I don't know trolls, I'm afraid. I'm all back in the home. You don't know that, do you? She looks like Holly. Trap? No, she looks a little... Oh, no. What is it? It's not Holly. It's her sister, Lily. She was reported missing, but I... Guess it just slipped through the cracks. We have to go tell Holly. Right. Who knows? She might know something about this. Who Lily was seeing. Well, certainly another troll. It's one word you for can't him. Go out there. Why not? It's too dangerous. Someone tried to kill you. Bigby, you let her you. Snow wants to come with me. I'm not gonna stop her. But leave now. But why? Ready? Yeah. Up, Jack. This whole thing is complete bullshit and always has been. Good job, really. To keep shit Sorry from about your arm. The woodlands. Jack, know where they are. You're a bar. You're supposed to have darts around. And I normally do, but who knows where the fuck they went to after. Hey, Grendel, want to give a round of applause? Come on, Holly. I need entertainment. You're about to get some. This'll do. 
Don't worry, I'm not gonna tear your other arm off. Probably. Holly, you got a minute? Why? Please, Holly. It's important. Miss what? I heard you had kind of a strange morning. It's been kind of a strange morning for everyone, I think. Every time I see this guy, he seems to lose weight. It's amazing. It, it really Are you is. Touching me? He loses weight and yet somehow keeps all the muscle. Jack. Wolfie, my Stop dear. Stop touching me. How are you? Stop touching me. Because we're just about you. All of us here. Be not in the mood right now. Well, I was in the mood to play darts, so everybody's getting what they want. I'm dying to hear about the body that came out this morning. Abel, right? Oh, it was. Tweedle D was just here. Really? He said it looked like Snow White. What the hell, Crane? Sorry. Tweedle D said you arrested him for no earthly reason. Kept him locked in the cellar all fucking night. He said you tortured him. Which, I don't know, that seems like a breach of your legislative duties. Big B, come what on. Legislative you duties. can't be so dumb as Jack, to. Jack, find the off button now. Seriously. What is it with you two? You and Gran are all, let's get a posse together when there's no one around. But as soon as the big bad wolf walks in, your tails go between your legs. He you just don't want to lose the other you. arm. Aren't you pissed? Cat got your nerve. What happened? What happened? I'm tired is what happened. Tired of what? Of trouble, Jack. I'm sick and tired of trouble. I don't want any more. Jack. What? Bigby, look. Two fables are dead. And shit, Gren's sister. Holly's sister. Holly's sister has been missing for what? A few days now? And we haven't heard word one about it from anyone. Hey, easy. Fuck out of ah, here. Fuck. What'd I do? Good. It's an honor. Ah! Go fuck on up a beanstalk, Jackie boy. Gren, you gotta learn some new lines. <laughs> Let me tell you. <laughs> All right, then. Actually. Have there been any updates? I don't know how to say this to you, Holly. The woman we found in the river. Who was it? You know who it was. God fucking damn it! Of course, the dear princess Snow fucking White is all safe and sound. Where were you when we reported this weeks ago, huh? Where are you when we ever fucking need you? If you'd give one ounce of a shit about her, about any of us, she might have been safe. She might have been cared for. She might have been... I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry we found your sister this way, and I... I wish this had ended up better. <sighs> Holly, get the fuck out of my bar. I just want It should have been you. It should have been you, and it wasn't. We recovered this from her personal effects. I thought you might like to have it. I... I didn't know she still had this. The copper was from a dwarf mine. It's very rare and very old. It's quite lovely. Gren. Yeah? Take off for a bit, would you? Are you sure? Handshake for no, you know, hard feelings. I don't know that much about her life. Honestly, we didn't talk often. She 
She was lost here, in the city. She just got sp Why were you two not talking? It seems so fucking petty now. Just... I with her. I think she was off the Monday drug. Cooking. To pay down debt. It ain't me up to see her that way. Eventually, the only people she owed were at her work. You know, that shithole club, the pudding and pie. The owner, George, fucking fees. It's a crock of shit. That's how they kept her under their thumb, really. Holly, it's okay. If it's too much, we don't have to do this. We've got a lead. Maybe we can take it from here? <laughs> Lily. Thanks for everything, Holly. Is there, um, is there anything we can do? To no. No, I'm better off dealing with things alone. I don't need sympathy and I don't need charity. It's not charity. It's looking out for our own. Is she? That's not exactly. Where is she? She's at the business office. She's taken care of. I'm gonna have to go down there and get her. Fuck. Please, we can handle the funeral arrangements. No, no, it's it's a kind of, it's a formality with trolls. Of course. Okay, good. Let's go down to the business office. It's not like we got fucking NCIS or shit to look into it. Right. That club? I'll go down there now. See what I can find out from the owner. You were good with her. I wonder if Dragon Wing is like Dragon Force. Really? I cannot be an asshole Thanks. sometimes. It just made everything easier. It's a really nice name for a hotel, just hotel. Oh, Sheriff, what a nice surprise. I'm not sure I've seen you here before. You're always welcome, of course. Is it business or pleasure? I've got some yes. questions for Georgie. Straight to business this time, then. Wow, a lot of people like Dragon Wing around here. He's here. Come on. I should warn you that Georgie does not like to be bothered when he's working. And he's Tough. in kind of a mood right now. I don't much care how he feels about it. <laughs> ah, well, you two will get along just swimmingly. This is gonna be fun. So what fable are you? Welcome to the Pudding and Pie, where we cater to the diverse tastes of the fable community. Your pleasure is our pleasure. Did you know Lily? She worked here? <sighs> My lips are sealed. You'd better ask Georgie. Yeah? <laughs> What do you think you're doing? You look like you're trying to take a shit. Who's gonna want that? No one's gonna want that. Nice guy. Seems like a real prince. You do have a sense of humor. That's good. Good luck. It's your face. You have to smile. You never smile. How many times do I have to say it? Oh, it's you. We're closed. Keep dancing, you. I didn't say stop. 
for fuck's sake. You, stay right there. Don't even think about sitting down. Leave her alone, asshole. Sure, whatever you say. What do you want, then? You here for a little taste? Tell you what, oh, come back after midnight, maybe. I can hook you up. Or, uh, knowing you, this is probably not quite your style. You'd prefer someone who can take a bit of a beating. Tell me, do you prefer a stationary target, or one that will put up a fight? Fuck you, Georgie. Fuck you, Georgie. I don't even it's sound anything like that. Jesus, Bigby, you're so corny. I love it, though. No, seriously, I love it. So, like, does the one tier mean you've only been one asshole, or what? Okay, all right, Sheriff. Just fucking with you. Look, I know why you're here. When did you hear about it? Listen, Sheriff. Around here, we can't afford to wait for you and your swanky pals to take an interest. We have to look out for each other. When shit happens, I hear about it. Especially if it concerns my livelihood. In that case, I assume you knew Lily was glamour. Of course she was, you daft git. She was a troll. No. I mean glamour to look like another fable. Yeah? Well, so what? Who gives a toss? People get up to all kinds of things when nobody's watching. I think you're behind this. You got her a black market glamour as part of some twisted sex fantasy. Ooh. Black market, is it? How exciting. This is exactly what I would expect from a thug like you. Storm in, throw around a bunch of accusations, try to scare people. But you've got fuck all to back it up. I ain't even started yet, bro. And we're all just meant to jump any time the wolf shows his teeth. Nothing to back it up? Well, what the fuck is this, then? Get that out of my face. I found it on no, Lily's body, and it's somewhere. definitely a back alley job. Where did she get it? You've got this all wrong. If Lily was doing a special glamour, it wasn't for me. For fuck's sake, I want that right. kind of eat. Who was she doing it for, then? She had clients, Bigby. Maybe one of them was into it. A lot of fucked up people in Fabletown. Like who? Try looking That's in the true. mirror. Anyway, I now did. to he do told with me. To rhyme. Go on, then. I really want to break that jukebox. You're gonna hit me. Go ahead. That's what you want to do, right? Yep. Oh no! Fuck. Exactly what I want to do. You take your sad fucking face where I can't see it. Bloody bastard! Fucking shit. You proud of yourself, mate? Proud of your little mess? Pretty proud. Fuck's sake. Fuck off, Hans. Hold on a minute. Hans, is it? Hans just cleans up and provides a little muscle when we need it. He's not gonna know anything. Well, he sounds like someone from the, the Witcher. Or any of that. No one knows. Don't you get it? It's by design. Discretion is our guarantee, right? And the way we guarantee that is that no one knows anything they don't have to know, including me. I cover my eyes and take my cut. End of story. Why not look it up? What's that? Isn't there a little book with all the stuff about the girls and all that written in You're it? You're a fucking moron. Show Thank me. you, Hans. There is no book. Need to work on your communication skills and have a fairly really, good idea gonna where do that to right start. Now. That ain't gonna hey, happen. That's my personal property. <laughs> Go ahead. Do what comes natural. Fuck. You about anything. Then here. Hey now. Thanks, I was out of smokes. Think about it. Are the TV? Look, Georgie, you just tell me where the book is. Can we please not go round and round about this? There's no, no. book. End of story. Mm, not the answer I was looking for. Do not 
touch that. You hear me? This? There's nothing to do Don't with it. Don't touch you. this. This. <laughs> that, yeah, has something to do with me now. Oh, well, what's well, this? what's this? Looks like a floor safe. Uh, I wouldn't know. It was here when we moved in. I don't have a key to it. Sheriff, will he come on? Fuck's sake, I've got to open up in a few hours. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, was it good for you, Sheriff? Next yeah, time, it's pretty good. Jesus, you're killing me. I'm begging you. I've I'll not pay yet. You. Oh, fuck's sake. I have a real hard time opening it up soon, you know that? It. Leave nothing there for you. You might stand back. Right, all right, all right. Got to do. Bloody come on, then. Like that voice sounds Fucking like someone from my Witcher, but over I can't. This bullshit. Protector of Place Fable it. down my ass. What a load of crap. Once again, don't get your hopes up. There's nothing in here that'll tell you anything. But it's a That's kick cool. to I'll the balls for me and my up. club, so we can be happy about that. Oh look, evidence. This last day, Georgie. Who's this Smith? Oh, I'm afraid it might be a fake name, Big B. Secrecy is sort of how this all works. Even Ants knows that. What's 207? Room number? I don't fucking know. Millimeters, maybe? Don't bullshit me, Georgie. This is your book. Yeah, don't your bullshit girl. me, Georgie. I'm the fucking secretary. I give them a stage. I give them music. I provide an erotic venue to attract and retain clients. But let's be clear on something. The girls make the arrangements with their clients, not me. Can I the girls. Help you? They're the ones with the Mr. Smiths, and Joneses, and Mr. X types. Whatever happens outside the club, that's on them. I log the business, take my cut, and I'm out. Now, I've had quite enough of you and your bullying. Excuse me while I call your superiors to make a complaint. Bitch, I am the superiors. Hello, business office. Thanks, I was out. Oh god, I want a cigarette. Yeah, that's right. Is that a Nokia? Let's go. Well, it breaks. Georgie. I really just want to take the phone and hit him with it. Fine. I want to talk to the deputy mayor. Yeah, whatever. Jewel box is broken. Lock's been busted open. What could you even hide in there? I guess money, maybe. Broken open, but there isn't even a lock. Lipstick, lip gloss, compact, glitter. Faith. Gotta have faith, faith, faith. Faith, thanks for covering for me tonight. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. Lily, one of Lily's clients. Is there anything else down here? Excuse me. I heard you out there. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. 
Somebody else said that to me on the way in. I mean, I guess we're all surprised. Oh, where's Pixel? You're trying to place me. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Hmm. Once upon a time. Does that help? What do they call you now? Whatever makes them happy. My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. Of course you do. How does it go from I don't have Nerissa answers. to Ariel? You'll have to find those yourself. Did you see Lily last night? You know, where she went or who she was with? We can't talk about work. This is a murder case. I mean can't. These lips are sealed. Discretion is our guarantee. Just like Faith. Just like It's how outside. things work here. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? This is what I need to know about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? I have to know. These lips. A spell. Would you like to make an appointment with me? Yes. Okay. What would I need to do? I need 150. It's not good to be short. It's okay. Yes, take it. Wait here for a second. Seven? You'll think of something. The open door. Biggest help. Got mm. all night. This is where they met. Enjoy your stay. I hope you find what you're looking for. Lucifer. Welcome to Hotel. Cola. Because Coca Cola is a brand name. That fan's not even doing anything. It's not spinning fast enough. Yeah, you have sprunk. Shit will kill you. Says the man smoking like a pack a minute. They should probably repair that. rooms or anything like the lobby they should cut their rates keep your pants on buddy you have to check in first if you want a room so come on sounds like Kristen Mosey Bell. on back and we'll get you set up I'm not here for a room 
Oh, uh, Sup, you fell. I work here, okay? I work the front desk. It's to help pay rent. So, now you know. I know I should have told somebody, but Beast would lose his mind if you knew. Beast is a proud man, Bigby. He wants to do right by me, and he... He just couldn't handle it well, if I had to do this so we don't get evicted. And have him you come really fucking work Beast. the front desk. He's Shit. worried about you. Bigby, I have to say, that night when you saw me, I really didn't appreciate you telling Beast when I expressly asked you not to. So, and I told you that you I wasn't going to do that. Oh, you have Getting up mouse was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie, Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh. Oh, yes. The, the... I did see her. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but she came off a tad intimidating. Ever see Lily with someone here? Maybe on a job? Sometimes, but nobody I've recognized. I haven't worked here that long, though. How about a room register? Or someone named Mr. Smith? <laughs> That's all we get here. Smiths, Jones, or Johnsons. I think the last one's <laughs> jokes. <laughs> That's good. Have you seen Snow White down here? Or maybe somebody glamoured as her? You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but she didn't say anything when she saw me. Even though she knew that I saw her, I just assumed it wasn't snow and went about my business. Ever meet a girl named Faith? Or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's, it's kind of a blur with all the names. Tara, Brandy, Amber, Heather... Sorry. I talked to Tweedledee earlier today. He mentioned you in passing. You know him or his brother? I took out you know, a loan. I might take some pole dancing pay. classes. It was like our third notice. And ever since then, those annoying freaks have been pestering me for the money plus interest. Why take out a loan from those two? <sighs> it so was from the crooked man. The what? You don't know how desperate I was, big. I had nowhere else to go. Look, the fuck is the crooked man? Again, come see me or Snow first, all right? I tried. Thanks. Wait. It'll be better if anyone sees you that they at least see you with me, so they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. Five minutes, please. We'll see. Beauty. Five minutes is all I need. I'm trying to kick you out. That won't be hard. Listen, Bigby, I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official report or something. Which is fine, it's just that I was wondering if I need to be in it. Do you have to mention my name? I mean, it's it's not like Beast would ever see your report. It's just... It's not much of a report if I start picking and choosing which facts to include. I see. Well, here we are. Which one like, was it? Like, that's understandable. It was... 207. Never sure why they have desks in a place like this. So you have something besides the bed to um, ride on. You yeah, inspectors through here very often. I don't know. What do you think? Finding what you're looking for. I wasn't expecting much in here. But isn't this why you're here? Why you have the key? No, the key was just to be sure I found the right hotel. This isn't the room Lily was using. Oh. So, are we done now? No. 
The nope. room they met in was 207. That's a really squeaky bed. You have keys to these rooms? The door. I thought you had a key. Not to this one. Hold on, Bigby. I can't just let you go into any serious. Don't you hear the crying out? baby in there? A lot. Totally hear a crying baby in there. I mean, just said doing my job. It's weird. He is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Ah, shit. Beast? Bigby? How did How you get to me? No, sweetie, no. Wait a minute. How could you do this? We've been together through everything. I took care of you. I love. It's not what you think. Please. You're cheating up with him. No, no, beast. Hey, I promise. Why was I'm that? Not. What does that mean? Helping him. That's all. I'll bet. I'm sure you help each other just great. This is a murder investigation. She's helping me. Stop lying to me. What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife. A lot. Please listen to me. There's nothing going on. I'm not. <laughs> Master, okay. I guess I finally see you for who you are. Stop, You're legit stop my it. favorite Disney character, but we're gonna have to night. do this. I should have fucking known. I don't want to hurt you, so just calm down and beast. I really don't want to fight my favorite Disney character. What the hell do you think you're win. doing? You aren't even listening to me. <laughs> She's my wife, Bigby! I told you! Just stop! Are we done? Stop! Nope, we're doing this. Okay. No one fights Leave like Bigby. No one this dance like Bigby. Cheating. Sorry. CIS going on. Smith, whoever he is. And then? Must have happened right here. Jesus. Last night? Yeah. I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work the front desk. Was anyone acting suspicious? Maybe moving a heavy piece of luggage or a... A rug? Got the body out of here somehow. Jesus Christ! No, no, I didn't see anything like that. Why are fables totally using Jesus night. Christ as How an is expletive? That even possible? There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. 
I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay? Sorry, Beast. You're still my favorite Disney character. Bigby, what kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. I can't believe this. Do all the rooms have these same clocks with the built-in cassette player? I think so, yes. Looks like with she was lying flowers. down she was killed. Flowers were already here. How do you know that? Blood what is there. in the closet? Oh, so I'd say the body was dragged off the foot of the bed. There. The body. Jesus. You could say she. Poor girl. I just can't even imagine. You can go. Like, you don't have to stay. We shouldn't even be in here. What is that? Beautiful. It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Monday version of her story, anyway. The whole book is about her? Fu yeah. Food a delicious empire? What? Was she breathing? Why is she in a Probably. glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. Hmm. You know, like when you are going What's through Stockholm mean? Syndrome and Beast Castle? Why mark the page where she's sleeping? I think he made up the bed to match the coffin in the picture. Flowers, too. He'd have had Lily lie down just like this. You mean just before? In the story, that's when someone comes to he kiss her. He did it? That's our Mr. Smith. Coffin and, and the weird fix. No. What the hell with this guy? Probably a lot. God. It's a huff and puff. I thought you were the only one who smoked that crap brand. Apparently not. Me. I love. It's the not crap wine. wine. Classy. Wait. What was the wine? <sighs> I think we've seen the bottle before. For my arrival. That's not. Poor girl. Up in a closet. Wow. Rough with this dress. It's torn. Someone sent her the oh, whole no. Renaissance thing. She must have been wearing it. He killed her and then and then he took it back off. No, there's no blood on it. It must have been torn some other time. What? What are you thinking? Maybe it was one of the seven dwarves? This is the same dress as the one in the book about snow. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it to recreate the snow from the book. You're right. It's the same dress. It fits. He's acting out scenes from the book. That poor girl. She couldn't have known. She probably just needed Ooh, the money. what was that? Could have oh, been it's Beast. Anyone. How did she wind up here? I mean here, but... Just how does a person... Georgie took advantage of her when she was in trouble. He's a real predator. Yeah. Look forward to... She must have been so scared. Bigby, this? I think I heard this music. Last night, it was playing pretty loudly for a while and then stopped in the middle. I didn't think twice about it at the time. I, I mean, you hear all kinds of things around here and I guess I've already gotten used to blocking them out. Could have covered up the sound of the murder. Where's... I mean, that much Maybe blood splatter on coming. the tables. That seems pretty... Is there anything else you can tell me about last 
Anything that sticks out in your mind. Sorry, no, it just seemed like every other night does. That's exactly what's bothering. And I'll just be down there imagining. T How can I find out who rented this room? Find whoever has the key? I'm pretty sure this one must be held long term. And we don't keep a register or anything. This place is intentionally kind of anonymous. I keep hearing that. Damn it. Like, what Get am I missing? Beauty. Be strong. Uh, oh, what's this? Do you smell something? No. Oh, it's an apple. Just apple. Gee, I wonder why that's there. Oh no, there's more? What? What now? Like, do you not watch Disney movies? It's got a single bite taken out of it, like in Snow Story. Oh no, do you think it was poisoned? It wasn't. Oh wait, what year did Snow White come out? I think it's just a prop. It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. This technically this is the 1980s. So when did Snow White come out? He's just acting out another part of the book. God, I can see the whole picture now. It, it all goes together like you said. This creep put that girl in a Snow White dress and, and recreated the whole story from the book with the apple and, and the deep sleep and everything. You're a better detective than I thought you'd be. Thanks. So uh, he planned it yeah. all out. What? He had all the details noted down. Only then, when it comes time to kiss her and wake her up. Yeah. I hope you're just did. about through. I don't really want to stay in here any longer. Just like the comic panel. This kind of stalking, it doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. His stand in for snow is gone now, so. The next. Who's watching us in the mirror? What is it? It's <gasps> Crane. Motherfucker. I mean, I'm still gonna fuck him up. He could be after you now. Good. I am dying to get my hands on that disgusting weasel. Yeah, let's do it. Let's kill him. There's no way he's behind all of this, though. He's not that competent. He's really starting to like you, Sheriff. You're not afraid to be a complete bastard. Obviously, there will have to be some changes. Get the fuck out of my desk. Hello, Big B. Take care of it, Big B, or I'll take care of it for you. Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? <laughs> That is where we're gonna end this stream. So, all right, let's see the uh, whatever. So, all right, so how did you respond to Crane about Snow's death? You on twenty seven percent accused him of not caring about her. Only twenty seven percent, really. Only twenty seven percent. Wow, y'all suck. Uh, how did you treat the murder suspect? You and fifty four percent of players forced him to talk. Oh, okay, that's kind of down the middle. Did you let Snow come with you to the trip trap? Yeah. Why not? How do you handle Georgie Porgies? Fuck yes, we hit him. Did you keep punching Beast when he was down? 
you and 19% of players opted not to hit beast a second time. Yeah, because be like, okay, you 80% of players who kept on hitting beast, fuck y'all. Beast is awesome. He's my favorite Disney character. Okay, that. Hold up. Okay. So that is where we're going to end it for this stream. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about the decisions. What were the decisions that you've made in this game uh, before? Or if you're replaying it now for whatever reason, uh, let me know what decisions you're making. What you think about my decisions. What you think is going to happen in the next episode. I uh, believe we have two more episodes. No, three more episodes after this. Um, so we'll keep doing that. Uh... Other than that, like I said, this is an episode of What You Gaming On, so if you want your answer featured in an upcoming video, let me know the game you're playing, what you like about it, what you don't like about it, and your answer will be featured in an upcoming video. Uh, if you want to check out any of my other videos, you can find them on this uh, YouTube channel, youtube.com slash tguillotine, or these videos and any of my written works on uh, treyguillotine.blogspot.com or any of the articles that I've written for the UNO Driftwood at unodriftwood.com. So let me know what you think, let me know what you like, let me know what you're gaming on, and subscribe to this channel to geek out some more. Thanks for watching, have fun.